OK, so I start this question by first writing down that y equals 4x cubed minus 1 plus 2x to the power half. We're told that x is greater than 0 and asked to find dy dx. Now when I'm wanting to differentiate any expression, first thing I do is look at each of the terms. We have three terms here and check that they're in the right format for differentiating. And that format that we're going to use, just to remind you over here, is that if you have anything where we have y equals a constant, let's say a, times x to the power n, where n is a constant, if we differentiate this with respect to x, then we would always get a times n, and then we reduce the power by 1. So we get a n x to the power n minus 1. And we have a special case here as well, that if we have a constant, as we have here, minus 1, when you differentiate any constant, so if y was equal to a, dy dx always equals 0. OK, so I'm going to use these ideas to differentiate y with respect to x. So I look at the first term, y equals 4x cubed. I'm in a position to differentiate straight off, so I always put therefore, therefore dy dx equals differentiating 4x cubed. So 4 times 3 is 12. Drop the power by 1, so we have x to the power 2. Negative 1 is a constant. So over here, when we have y equal to constant, differentiating respect to x gave 0. So we'll just leave that off since it's 0 when differentiated. Then we come on to this next term, plus 2x to the half. So differentiating this, we have plus 2 times 1 half is 1. I'll just write it in. And then we have x, we drop the power by 1, so we have x to the negative a half. OK? That basically is the answer. You might want to carry on though and tidy it up a little bit more. So we have 12x squared on the first term and then x to the minus a half is really the same as 1 over x to the power half times it with the 1 so it's just going to stay as 1 over x to the power half. OK? So hopefully you've got that and uh, well done.